The Magic of Oz, the 13th book in L. Frank Baum's iconic Oz series, epitomizes the whimsical and adventurous spirit that defines the Land of Oz, published posthumously in 1919. The novel continues Baum's legacy of imaginative storytelling, blending fantasy with lessons of morality and courage. The plot centers around a young munchkin boy named Kiki Aru, who discovers a magical word, PYRZQXGL, that enables him to transform into any shape he wishes. This newfound power leads Kiki down a path of mischief and ambition. His journey intertwines with that of the mischievous Gnome King, Regido, who has been stripped of his power and exiled from the Gnome Kingdom. Regido, ever the antagonist, sees Kiki's magic as an opportunity to regain his former glory and seeks to use the boy's abilities for his own nefarious purposes. Parallel to Kiki and Regido's schemes, the story follows familiar Oz characters such as Dorothy, the wizard, and the cowardly lion, who embark on a mission to find a birthday present for Princess Ozma. Their quest introduces them to a variety of magical creatures and challenges, highlighting the rich and diverse world Baum has created. The juxtaposition of these two storylines underscores the central themes of good versus evil and the importance of using power responsibly. Baum's narrative style in The Magic of Oz remains consistent with his previous works, characterized by a whimsical tone and a sense of childlike wonder. The prose is straightforward, making it accessible to young readers, yet it does not shy away from exploring complex themes such as the consequences of unchecked ambition and the value of friendship and loyalty. One of the novel's strengths lies in its character development. Kiki Aru's journey from a curious boy to an aspiring sorcerer reflects a classic coming-of-age tale, albeit with a fantastical twist. His interactions with Regido serve as a cautionary tale about the corrupting influence of power and the dangers of aligning oneself with those who seek to exploit others for personal gain. In contrast, the steadfastness and bravery of Dorothy and her companions exemplify the virtues that Baum consistently champions throughout the Oz series. The settings in The Magic of Oz are vividly described, each location brimming with its own unique charm and magical elements. Baum's ability to create a sense of place is evident as he transports readers to the remote forest where Kiki Aru first discovers his powers, the treacherous mountains where Regido plots his revenge, and the familiar, enchanting landscapes of Oz. These richly detailed environments enhance the reader's immersion in the story and contribute to the overall sense of wonder that defines the series. Despite its fantastical elements, the novel also offers poignant reflections on real-world issues. Through Kiki Aru's misuse of magic and Regido's relentless pursuit of power, Baum explores the ethical implications of authority and the responsibilities that come with it. The resolution of the story, which sees Kiki Aru redeemed and Regido thwarted, reinforces the idea that true strength lies in compassion and integrity rather than domination and deceit. The Magic of Oz also features Baum's signature blend of humor and warmth. The interactions between the characters are often infused with light-hearted banter and playful exchanges, providing moments of levity amidst the narrative's more serious undertones. This balance of humor and gravity is a testament to Baum's skill as a storyteller, ensuring that the novel remains engaging and enjoyable for readers of all ages. In conclusion, The Magic of Oz encapsulates the enduring appeal of L. Frank Baum's Oz series. Through its imaginative plot, well-developed characters, and thoughtful exploration of moral themes, the novel continues to captivate readers and reinforce the timeless values of kindness, courage, and the responsible use of power. Baum's ability to weave together elements of fantasy and reality creates a narrative that is both enchanting and meaningful, solidifying his legacy as one of the great storytellers of children's literature.